through globalization, um, Ghanaians could, you know, ask and travel outside, go and learn certain things from uh, other countries, be it agriculture, you know, IT, whatever, and then use that knowledge that they have gained from there to uh, come back to Ghana to also help in such areas in Ghana. Uh, so it allows for people to, you know, learn from places like country to country. You can move from one place to other to learn and you can gain experience from, from that, yes. Yeah, it would have been very bad in the sense that, you know, a country like Ghana, without globalization, how would we have been able to, you know, move from where we were? Maybe what we don't have, when we trade with others, we can get it. And what we have to, we can export it and earn the needed, uh, the foreign needed exchange, foreign exchange to manage the country. So there's a lot of benefit one stands to gain when you trade with outside world. Yeah, uh, know-how, technical know-how, goods and services across the country, you can benefit. So by so doing, you expand your economy. The frontiers of your economy will expand it. That is how I see it. Well, it is very, 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 very beneficial because it's uh, marketing that controls the whole world. So marketing internationally is very beneficial. It brings a lot of money into the country. If we don't relate, we'll still be in a primitive world because the, the world is now a, a global village. As, as I'm talking with you here, maybe satellite is setting out something that someone is watching in some way. So it needs the country to make it very urgent to relate. That is why we are crying for investors to come. They come in and they create jobs. So it, will, it is beneficial for investment to come into this country.